With Storyboard 3.0, if you have an iOS developer account, you can prepare a prototype for your iOS device. After setting up code design, as well as a code signing certificate, you only need the following. The device ID of the product you're running on, the identifiers of the applications that you're making, and a provisioning profile. When you're all set up, you're ready to get started with the iOS export feature. Just go to File, Export, and select Export as a native iOS application. After you select the model file that you want to use, you can set your application name and add your company identifier, and you're also given options to set native application properties, like landscape or portrait, or application scaling, or whether or not you want to use a display title bar. When you continue, you can set your runtime options, including your signing identity and provisioning profile. You can also add custom icons and launch screens from this menu. When you're ready, just click finish, and from there, your app file gets created. After you've completed your iOS export, navigate to your project folder to find the app file that you've just created. An easy way to add it to your iTunes library is to drag and drop to the iTunes window and it will automatically be added to your list of apps. Then when you connect your iOS device, go to the tab for apps and there you should see your application in the app list. To install to your device, just click the install button and then go to the bottom right and press apply to sync the app with your device. When the installation is finished, your iOS device will be able to run your app. Create the applications that let you showcase your ideas. Develop and refine your designs in Storyboard and then use them on your targeted device. You can generate rich animations, display 3D models, and build the creative solutions that will enrich the user experience.